do that. BBC America breakout drama Killing Eve is on its way to award season glory as it leads the nominations for the 2018 Television Critics Association Awards with five mentions, while FX is tops among networks with ten noms. Killing Eve, which is from Fleabag creator Phoebe Waller-Bridge, took home a pair of nominations for individual achievement in drama for stars Jodie Comer and Sandra Oh and was shortlisted for Outstanding New Program, Achievement in Drama and the prestigious Program of the Year. <laughs> FX's The Americans came in second, with the final season scoring nominations for leads Matthew Reese and Carrie Russell, Achievement in Drama and Program of the Year. Hulu's dystopian nightmare The Handmaid's Tale earned nominations for Program of the Year and Achievement in Drama after winning both categories last year, while FX's Atlanta did the same in individual achievement in comedy for star and creator Donald Glover and Achievement in Comedy. According to TCA president and The Hollywood Reporter TV critic Daniel Feinberg, the success of shows like Killing Eve and The Americans and Barry all underline what a killer year this was for TV. It's an exciting time for television and the TCA Awards nomination show how much great programming there is and how it can be found anywhere and for every audience. We recognize shows from broadcast, cable, premium cable, streaming and PBS, series aimed for the youngest of children, the most mature of adults and for viewing by the entire family. From sexy assassins to brooding spies to babies who are Muppets, I'm excited to see which series will rise to the top when we gather together on August 4th. The awards are voted on by more than 200 television critics and journalists across the country. Winners will be announced Saturday, August 4th at the Beverly Hilton Hotel in Beverly Hills during the TCA Summer Press Tour. The ceremony will be hosted by BET's Robin Thede. For a full breakdown of the networks and programs that are nominated for TCA awards, head to THR.com. For The Hollywood Reporter News, I'm Lindsay Rodriguez.